Do you struggle with scrolling on social media late at night when you're thinking, I probably should be going to sleep, but, and you just keep scrolling on social? Well, I feel like I might have the perfect solution for you in regards to that that I just found out recently, which I wish I would have known about sooner. And it's a part of your phone. So it's a feature on your phone or potentially an app that you might have to download. Um, but I find it so helpful and you're actually setting a bedtime for yourself. I know that sounds so weird because, you know, when I think of a bedtime, I think the kids need bedtimes. I don't need a bedtime. And I've tried to even set an alarm for myself that goes off and reminds me like, okay, it's 11 o'clock. I need to be going to bed now. And I never go to bed. <laughs> I just, I lay in the bed but then I just scroll on social media or I watch YouTube videos. So I always, I shouldn't say always, but I've struggled a lot recently trying to go to bed as opposed to scrolling on social media because I've wanted to get up earlier in the morning and get more accomplished. And so now I actually, and I'm gonna share screenshots over here so that you can see what I'm looking at as well. This is a, clock option on my Android phone. Now I do have an Android phone and I can't, I'm a, from what I remember, I think it was on the phone when I got it, but I'm assuming you can have this with, I'm assuming this kind of feature is probably available on other, um, you know, Apple phones as well too, but I go into the clock feature on my phone and I'm going to share with you, I'm going to share a picture here and I click on where it says bedtime and I actually set the time that I want to go to bed at and the time I want to wake up at and I do have a room a an alarm so you can have the option to create an alarm with it I do have an alarm created so that it wakes me up at six in the morning as well the the benefit that I find with this particular feature is that at 11 p.m. I have it set so that it goes the bedtime mode is grayscale. And so what happens is at 11 o'clock, my phone turns gray. So it's really hard to see like on YouTube or social media, you're typically seeing colors and you're, you know, you're wanting to see the colors as you're scrolling. You're like most of the time they relate to the graphic or the picture. And so when your phone goes gray, it's harder to get excited about seeing these pictures because it's a great gray scale. So I've actually found this extremely helpful for me to actually realize, okay, I'm going to go to bed. Like this is an indicator. I need to shut my phone off. I can't see like if I'm on YouTube, I'm like, I might be checking out different videos that, have like, you know, clothing options or something. And I'm like, well, I can't see the colors. So I'm just going to shut this off. And it actually has been very helpful. And it's made me go to bed actually on time most of the time. So I wanted to share that feature with you in case that this might be something that helps you to go to bed when you actually want to go to bed and not scroll on social media. And so I just want to let you know that every Friday I'm going to be sharing some sort of fun feature. If it's a, it could be an app, it could be a software or program or service. So I wanted to let you know that if you're interested in seeing different new features, make sure you're subscribed to my channel and make sure you hit the bell next to it so that you're notified when I share these types of videos along with the other videos that I share within my channel as well to help you live a more streamlined, efficient, and less stressed life in your day-to-day -day life. So thank you for tuning into this video and I hope you enjoyed it.